So yo, what's up guys? In today's video, we're going to Southwest Car Show, a brand new car show based in Bristol. It's going to be taking place in the Ash Ashton Gate. Ashton Gate Football Stadium. I think it's the Bristol Football Team Stadium. Hopefully it's going to be a good one. It's run by Gav, who does Cardiff, Manchester, etc. And his events are always decent. Hopefully it'll be good, but same old. We're just going to look around, see what we can buy. Show you guys our pickups. Obviously what we have for sale as we're on our way there to sell as well. So we show you what we have for sale and stuff like that as well. So yeah, guys, make sure to like and subscribe if you like car show videos. We always do a ton of them and you guys seem to love them. So yeah, let's get into it. Make sure to like and subscribe and let's go. So boom, loading up. For the event, we're going to be in the sports bar of this stadium here, which is the Brighton City FC Football Club, I think. Uh, so yeah, we're in the sports bar. Everyone is getting ready. So yeah, let's go. So boom, we have set up now, and as you can see, right is our booth. We've got a little bit of the background as well. So let's show you we've got, obviously we're starting off with the slabs. We've got some of the recent returns, plus some older bits as well. So here is like the more expensive stuff, like over the 100-ish or 150-ish, I think. And then we've got like Rainbow Zards, Alts, Trainers up here. Then we come to like Alt Arts. Don't know if you can see with the reflection, but you got Alt Arts there. Alt Arts, Shinies, Full Arts, SARs. And then a bit of Vintage, Vintage. Then Pikachus, Gold, and Charizard, Pikachu. And then I got, well, I'll put one Worlds, even though I got like 20 of them. Uh, but that's all I can fit. I got too many slabs now. I used to be able to fit like one and a half. And now we're filling boarded. I might have to get a third table for the next show but yeah we've got the binders here so as you can see we've got the tie as you can see tie shiny cards that i bought in really good value for money for those and then you've got like a little 151 page a lot of these have sold on ebay this pikachu is awesome uh so yeah that's nice and then we got like full arts gold secrets full arts uh full arts for character airs and it goes into like these it's all categorized ish but the languages are all over the place uh, then we got a vintage binder. You guys know our vintage binder. Four, uh, four pound each, and then you get some deals as well. Then you got a football binder with the autographs, and that is there as well. So that's the binder section. We got the mystery graded cards, which you can buy on Famous Grail. These are super popular at the shows. Uh, then we got some Yu-Gi-Oh as well. New Yu-Gi-Oh stuff. Um, booster boxes here. Uh, but yeah, as you can see, we've got so much selection. I'm just gonna hover over, but you can find all these on our website or in our YouTube streams as well. Uh, and then we got like uh, the files. We got this file as well. This is the Kleber Snow Hazard one. New One Piece. These and look at that. Look at this box, guys. This is so cool. Such a cool box. 60 pack box that is. V Star Universe there. Then we got like Thai Tag Team, Sun and Moon, 151, Chinese and Eat the Japanese. We've got Japanese, they've got a simplified Chinese fat packs. They've got the VMAX Climax Chinese. Then we've got all the packs here as well. Let's go through them. As you can see, just pretty much every like Sword and Shield set, and then a few other ones as well. So boom, boom. There we go. We've got the one piece there, and then boom. That is the front of the shop. Now we'll go to the back. So we've got some extra booster boxes here. Obviously, we didn't bring all our stock because not everything fits in the car. We've just got a few extras, mainly the sealed, loose pack cell. But we've got some booster boxes in case everyone wants to buy them. Uh, we got ETBs here. Uh, so Evolve Sky, Scarlet Paldia, Files, Korean. We've got a ship, One Piece ship, Bandai figure. We've got a tag team GX box, the Reshi Zard one. Umbreon Chinese 25th anniversary. We've got the Chinese box here as well, 151. We got these EX boxes, booster boxes. Uh, we got the ship. We got gym boxes. These are the V Star Universe. You got the Starbuff premium box there. Some extra ones just to hold the sign down. Put some weight on it. This new Annihilate box, look at the size difference. And we've got all the V boxes, uh, v, no, some other ones, blisters, Yu Gi Oh! So that's pretty much everything here today. And then, yeah, we'll let you know how the day goes. I'm going to go around now. So it's two floor event. I believe this is the venue where you see that viral clip of everyone throwing the beers. I'll insert here. Yeah, we've got my boy Chibi there. We've got Pokey Dean, Pokey Chloe over there. So we're gonna check them out. There is also an upstairs bit, as you can see. So Mary's there, and then yeah, we're gonna check out everyone out. So yeah, pretty cool some venue. So yeah, you can get a drink while you here. KFC right outside. So pretty cool. So boom, there we go, guys. Famouscroll.com. If you aren't able to make it into the event, you can always check out our website, famouscroll.com. We have literally all of this on the website. Some bits not, but majority of it is on there. So yeah, check it out, guys. So boom, with my boy Pokey Stu. Shout out Pokey Stu. You alright? Yeah. Well, boom, let's have a look at his table. So obviously we've got some slabs here. 
one thing that catches my eye is the Korean moon brion. You know, a lot of a lot of people opening Korean right now. But yeah, you'd be surprised the value like this. So sold day are like one over a grand in the USA. So crazy, crazy. So yeah, they, at the value they are really good value for money. It's Lugi, it's beautiful. PSA 10 Misty's Gyarados. Some waifus. That's a pretty cool. I love the black and white trainers. But some Japanese trainers as well. Anything else crazy? What else we got? Oh yeah. Ah, oh, Japanese. That looks sick. I like this Call of Legends. What Call of Legends one there? A lot of English. Japanese. Japanese. Oh yeah. That's a glaze on me, sir. There we go. So look at the binders there. We've got packs and that. Oh, we've got the boxes. Some uh, booster boxes here, different TCGs. Like we've got Jurassic Park Panini TCG. Uh, we've got some WWE as well. These cool figures. And yeah, he's got some more ETBs in the back as well. So, yo. So, boom, pick this up off my boy Stu with the Silverwood AR plus the Skeletor Ridge. So, I bought a few on eBay and they, always, they came with whitening. This one's pretty clean, so shout out to Stu. They'll be great in these with Ace Grading. Use my code Viv on Ace Grading, guys, 5% off. Yeah, I'm going to do a Palia Evolve Scarlet and Violet return or submission with them. But yeah, let's go. We've got a Welsh card collector here. We've got some cards here. I just picked up this, this Trico with a Cosmic Hollow. Celestial Storm Stamp as well is pretty cool. And then just a nice cheapy Pikachu promo, why not? Yeah, shout out to you, bro. Appreciate it. Always bothering. Low balling. <laughs> so I got, so finally got a deal. So boom, with my boy Chibi Collectibles. Let's go. But yo, my guy always got the biggest. Thing. Look at this. All ponchos. Look at that, Ray. Uh, Magic Carp, Charizard, Skull, we got the Munches. Bro, the price keep going up, you can't, oh, you can't yeah, put they're the price crazy. up. They you can't put crazy. the price up. Yeah, Is that yeah. why they got no prices? Well, some of these, I got all these yesterday. Oh, okay. Um, these ones are just, I'm open to offers, let's just say that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. I've got the Gal of Friends. These, this is crazy right now for just a regular CHR. Got this one that's been up recently. And then, yeah, we've got the, what's that, Lana, right? Yeah, the Lana. That's, that's big. What's, what's that price like? Between 2.5 to 3 at the minute. For 2.5 to 3, guys. It's crazy. That's English, right? Yeah, English. English, Japanese, Japanese. And we've got the Marnie Japanese as well. This one, oh, I, 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 <laughs> I should have went straight to that. 7.5. Is, is it just hard 10s or something? Yeah, I think there's pop 93 on them. But oh, they're yeah. just hard to grade. You can't yeah, open yeah. the packs that often. It's crazy. Yeah. Crazy, crazy. Then part, part owned by uh, Pokey Chloe. And oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Hey, what else we got? We've got the waifus here as well. Some waifus. What's it? Trainer galleries and uh, old arts there. Some more old trainers, golds. In the big dog. Oh, yeah. Oh, another big one. How come it's over there alone? Oh, I forgot to pause it. There's so lie. much space there, isn't it? Hey, we've got a, what's it? PSA oh, 10, okay. fast fishing here. Yeah. Then boom, our God Pack Pika. Another trainers in there. Pika promos. Got a lot of Pika promos. Got some older full arts here, golds, golds and shinies, Pika, evolutions, and yeah, nice bits and bobs, different variety down here. And we've got like shinies, we've got like full arts of the binders, and we've got the, the crazy plushy collection, all sorts of years, right? Like, they're not like yeah, just all, recent. Yeah, they're all like exclusive Van Pressos and Pokemon Center from everywhere. Yeah, they're all like official yeah. ones, aren't they? Yeah. All official. Uh, there's some crazy on that. Like, what, what, what's that one? Blastoise costume. Yeah, yeah. So this. One. Oh, why didn't they make a Blastoise co uh, Poncho Pikachu, man? This one, little sleepy bag one. Oh wait, hold on. Oh my god, that is that cold. One. That is sick. <laughs> yeah, so you you sell them on your website or just it's no, literally just, just the just exclusive, the and then that's a buy a few shops with them. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you got you got guys gonna check out <laughs> Chibi whenever he's at a show for these crazy. Like, look at this, my guy. All the Pikas, all the little plushies there. I appreciate it, bro. Thank, Thank you. you. I have to grab that small like keychain. You can put this in like a car window. So shout out to Chibi. Okay, we're here. Yo, yo. Collector's card house table. I'm giving yo, you the, the number one tour of Viv's All channel. right, let's go. Shout He's doing all the work for me because I, I don't know what I'm looking at apparently, half the time. So, okay, so this is yeah. the vintage section. All we've right. Got blisters. we got some graded uh, champion promos right oh, here. Oh, yeah. See, quarter finest. We've got top 32, top 16. What year is this one? Uh, oh, wait. This is 07, I think. Oh, 07. I think, yeah. Uh, we've got Gold Star Flareon. I actually, I love this Mew. Uh, this Mew is so sick. Uh, there's a non holo and holo version too. Oh, yeah. Uh, then we got some vintage booster packs, Fossil, Base, Base 2, Holland Phantoms. Gold What's the most expensive vintage pack? Uh, maybe... Delta Species? How much is how much is Delta Species? Uh, is that most expensive? Single packs are like five hundred. So between probably like 
Del Speedy's one of the most expensive single pack is yeah, Del Speedy's one of them. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and then we obviously got the Expedition Blister. I love that blister. It's oh, so that's sick. So sick. Team Rocket Returns blister is coming off. Oh yeah, right here. Right it's a little right bit hidden. Yeah. Oh, little hidden gems and that. Yeah, so you got to dig deep to find some good uh, stuff. Yeah. We've got the mystery packs. Oh yeah, these are sick. You guys already seen the video on the channel. Yeah, these. you pulled the Charizard. Uh, I couldn't yeah, yeah. believe I've got, it. I've got silver as well. I couldn't believe it. Uh, uh, we've got some hidden face tins. Oh yeah. Something new that we picked up quite recently is uh, oh, some cool. Sun and Moon three pack blisters. Yeah, some good sets. You've got Team yeah. Ultra Prism and that. This set or this like type of uh, tag teams are just blowing up at the moment. Yeah, yeah, so yeah especially got, those ones. Yeah. yeah. Um, we got sleeve bit boosters as well. Oh yeah. This is something we picked up oh, quite recently. Oh yeah, I saw a picture of those. Yeah, these are sick. So what packs are there? Uh, so in here packs. you can get. It's not guaranteed every time, but you can get uh, yeah, two hot gold seals, two gold. <laughs> <laughs> She's throwing me off. Buy it. Two hard gold soul silvers. Yeah. You can get Stormfront, Arceus, or Supreme Victors. I think some of them have platinum plates. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Some really nice packs though. They are quite quite expensive. I oh, see. So got the Japanese boosters. Got some Japanese boosters. We got some single sleeve. I remember picking these up at like Sainsbury's. Yeah, they got the Sainsbury stickers. I know. <laughs> um, then we have platinum poster box. Oh yeah. Greatest slabs. Oh yeah. Um, we got actually fourth print here too, which is a little bit lighter. Yeah, it says on the it says on the slab. Oh, yeah, they big. Uh, a whole array of booster packs. We've got from one five one hidden fates, cosmic eclipse, and then literally every set of sword and shield, and then scarlet and violet too. So loads of cool stuff. Some theme decks, binder. Uh, which just has some really cool Pikachu promos in it. Oh yeah, I've seen those on the Insta and Yeah, they're really nice. Um, and then Come moving on, over here. So this is the thing why I grabbed Dean today, guys. <laughs> uh, he just does all the work, I'm just recording. Then we have collection box. Oh yeah. Got so many, got loads of collection boxes. Um, just ones you we've had over the years. So we've got mm. the Flare and VMAX box. I actually oh, got those, those are sick, man. Yeah, we got this. So the last box. Evolution one? Yeah. We've got a sealed, sealed deck of Heart Gold Soul Silver Triumphant. How much is that? Uh, 900. 900. Uh, and then some Dragon Ball, Pixar, Hidden Fates. I love that. Yeah. And then we also have Dragon Majesty. And these, in my opinion, are super these underrated. Are Which one's the good one? Uh, they're the both. Good one's got a team up. Yeah, they're both good. So this Zamazen has team up, and I think Zashian has Unbroken. Oh no, they're both Zamazen. I think the other one I has like... I think the Zamazenta was the better one, maybe. Yeah, yeah, they both have sick packs, though. Um, I think they're a good Oh, yeah, we've got some generation boxes as well. Oh, yeah, and Shining Legends. Oh. Peak was one here. Uh, I might have to grab some bits yeah. there, you know. Let me know. Let what me you know. Say, give me a good... What's, what are you saying, Shining Legends and the Dragon Majesty box? Let me, let me uh, refer to the price manager. All right. And we can get back to something. What is okay. it? This one, Shining that Legends. That one and the uh, Dragon Majesty. 150 and 100. So boom, picked this up from Collector's Card House. Thank you, Dean, for the deal. Got a Shining Legends box, a Dragon Majesty box. These will be open on channel channel eventually, guys. So yeah, why not? Something different for the channel, but yeah, let's go. So boom, also picked up these mythical collection boxes from my people at the Collector's Card House. Beautiful Celebi and Mew Primer. But yeah, these are gonna be ripped along with the Shining Legends and the Dragon Majesty box we bought earlier. These are pretty cool. Uh, so yeah, let's go. Right, let's go, guys. We are watching cricket while working here, so. That one was for my mate over there, he put this on. He managed to get them to put this on, that's crazy. Right, there's some mystery slabs here, let's see what we got. We are after CGC, right? Uh, yeah, but I'm set up for Ooh, That's not bad. I'll take that. Rainbow 10, let's go. I love that. Um, what do you got? Something. Oh, Ace again. Oh, shiny, was it pink urchin? Yeah. Shiny star V. Yeah, not bad, not bad. Yeah, I appreciate it, guys. So boom, we're here Hill Valley. We've got an awesome selection of slabs here, as you can see. So many sick ones. What's the most expensive one you got? I just sold one for 600 earlier. Oh, so yeah. I see you got the Rainbow Zard in the line. They always want to grade. A couple of Japanese primes. Oh, Japanese yeah, nice. Gold. Oh, Japanese do really nice pull up. These three is a sequential set from Promo Pack. Oh, nice. What's the 600 pound one? I keep forgetting the name, but it's the, the wife boot from Celestial Storm. Oh, Lucia? Yeah. Oh, what, English? Yeah. Yeah, I, can't, I don't even know if I'm pronouncing it right. That's so. why I keep getting it wrong. <laughs> yeah, we've got a trader <laughs> section here as well. There you go, boxes and that. So many, too many slabs, right? Yeah, way too many. <laughs> I'm opening my little shop next to me. 
Oh yeah, I saw, I saw, I saw his cigarette. Sick. Needs to chill out. Yeah, yeah. Yo, we've got the Pokey underscore Senna here. We've got some slabs, we've got some older packs. Shining Legends, some EX Ruby. I think these are like the Portuguese ones or something. Black and white in there. And we've got some tins, are these? Cool tins you don't see often, like GX tins. You know, like the original ones. Sometimes the best way to tell the original prints that sticker on the top. I don't think they had a reprint anyways with those ones. Like that evolution style, but yeah, this one here. We got a Celebi one now, pretty sick. And we've got an awesome load of slabs here as well. Some nice selection. And we also got some awesome boxes like this Gengar one here, Gengar EX. And they got the USA Hidden Fates boxes. I'm not sure if you guys have seen these before. It's like a collection box, but you, they come in tins in the UK. I feel like one of the supermarkets in America got a box like that. Which is cool. We got Bads Gaming here. Let's go. We got this cool Johto GX box. We got the uh, figure box, the cool Pikachu promo. We got the Umbreon box, some other bits here as well. We got the Hidden Fates there. And over here, we do have a cool Unified Minds hangar box, I think they're called. A lot of different packs. We have these blisters as well. XY Steam Siege Guardians Rising. Arceus box and got some slabs as well. So shout out to Bad's Gaming did me a deal on the Unified Minds three packs. So these were like one of the supermarkets in America again, US exclusive. Comes with three packs of Unified Minds. So yeah, we'll throw it out. I might hope to play in the future video. If we find some more tag team stuff, uh we'll open it. So well, we've got a Ricky Thunder here. Let's see what we've got. So I saw some cool bits in this one. These EV promos are amazing. So EV, like you obviously got a Poncho Pikachu's, but have you ever seen Poncho EVs? I almost bought a set of these back at uh, when they were cheaper. I see a lot more now. We've got the Sylvie on there. Oh, Umbreon one's beautiful. But the nine. Oh, that's nice. I'll try to show you each one of these with a Jolteon. What's in there? Oh, is this is a full set. <laughs> Casually. Oh wow, that's the full set there. So there's only a few in there then. Just the one. Yeah, uh, that's the full one. Yeah. Oh wow. Yeah. I remember when they were there was a cheap online. I didn't yeah. pick them up back when they were cheaper. Yeah, because that's a big one. Like, yeah. 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 Everyone knows the Pikachu ponchos, but not EV ponchos, man. They see you on the poncho. Oh. I try. Yeah, I'm trying yeah. to buy. Now, look at that. You got that first edition Dark Raichu there. Any other? Bit? What's the most expensive ones here then for sales? Is just in here mainly. Uh, Oh, oh, my big Oh, yeah. What's that? 8,000. Top nine. Oh. And these Neo Rev ones are sick as well. First edition, first edition unlimited. You got the old oh, Moltres there as well. So, yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. That's a beautiful cards there. Better give that back to you before that falls in there. Put the 20 pound cards. Let's go. We've got the carry on prints. Let's go. So, obviously, we've been here last time. we got some awesome. Booster boxes, got Celestial Storm, Unbroken. Awesome selection of Japanese booster boxes. A lot of Sun and Moon era stuff here. And you got some bangers <laughs> of slabs like that Zard, Shiny Zard. Those are expensive now, as you can see. And you got that sort of Jelly Lunala, Old Rosa, Full Art. Some bits up there. And you got some singles. Look at the, I like the single display, Mine's like how it's all priced and laid out. It's pretty cool. And you got a Gold Scar, right? Could you chill it? Actually, Nina Rice. Let's have a look. See, it's nice, convenient, but yeah, crease on that one. So I got the Entei and Suicune in a 7 and a 9, so it's a little bit higher condition. That's pretty cool. I think they print these stands, so that's really, really sick, actually. Where they all lit out. Nice. So, but we've got two boxes from Carry Out Prince. We've got that Dark Order. I think this one's got a Jasmine. I'll put Chase on the screen. And Forbidden Light is just a box that I've never actually broken or opened before. I mean, you can't really see the artwork, but I put the Chase card on the screen as well. So yeah, two cool boxes for our streams in the store, so yeah, let's go. So then we've got Steve the Collector now, we've got some slabs, we've got some props. We've got some Japanese bags, uh, Chinese as well. A binder of singles, which looks cool, we'll have a look at that in a bit. There we go, Japanese, we've got some booster boxes, and yeah, nice selection, nice variety of stuff. Some, some of the rings as well. So but shout out to Steve the Collector. We grabbed some singles here. So we got beautiful Pikachu's there. We got the Eevee promo in there. My CP promo Keldeo there as well. Some beautiful cards. So yeah, shopping up now. We're actually buying some quite a few bits. We'll take it. So we got some cool customs. I think these are made out of energy cards. We got some slabs there as well. We got this cool figure, which is pretty sick. Now we got some more products, some more boxes, packs, and that. We got some slabs. Some slabs here as well. 
some old art Korean in there, some Vsauce Universe, got some golds, some old binders, you right? Got RL Pokemon rips here, so yeah, we've got the binders of stuff here, we've got some 151, some different booster packs, different sets. Oh, we got even got like Celestial Storm, don't see packs of that often. And there's some other packs over there as well. So we've got Hachiko trading cards, I think. So but we've got some binders and stuff here. As you can see, there's like some vintage stuff there. We've got some awesome selection of packs. I know it's dark, I should turn the flash on. Let me turn flash on. There we go, that is way better now. We can see the packs. As you can see, we've got Flash Flyer, uh, Rising Rivals, Generations Black and White. So we've got like Sun and Moon and XY, Platinum, Black and White, a bit of everything here, Sword of Shield. Then we've got some cool collection boxes like Detective Pikachu, we've got the SP on GX box in the back. And we've got our Dragon Majesty one that I bought earlier today with the Legends, uh, the Johto GX box, the EV Heroes, Japanese. Japanese one there, which is nice. So we've got like comics and collectibles on Code UK. We've got comics, I've never seen a comic at a card show ever, only at Comic Cons. And then we've got a mixture of like Digimon, Yu-Gi-Oh, Pokemon in there. Funko Pops figures. We got, is these Lego figures? Yo, this, he's bringing the variety, I love it. Love to see it, something different. Cause I know you guys say it's always the same stuff. Man's got Harry Potter figures, Indiana Jones. Really nice variety, pretty cool shop this is. So that is his store, I guess. So check it out guys. We got the card layer .co UK here. Let's see what we got. So we got some singles. We got some Yu-Gi-Oh as well, which is nice. And then boom, I saw these earlier. These are pretty cool. So yo, you got that, that old art of the red eyes, you got the blue eyes, love those old arts. So also what vending? I think they're vending ones. Those are pretty sick. So boom, we'll Caldera collectibles. Let's go. So boom, we've got some crazy stuff here. We've got a first edition first edition type flosion there. That's the that's the one hard to get 10, right? Yeah. An expensive one. Lines, often. Yeah, you're not great it well. No, to... it's probably about seven, I reckon. Seven, yeah. Six or seven, maybe. And then we've got like Venus, Sword, Alakazam, Expedition. We've got the, was that Starter Deck? So the Expedition in English, Charizard. This one's one of my favorite. Plasma Storm, the golden one. Really, really nice line there. What else? Oh, Gold Star. Gold Star and a seven. Any other? Well, any other expensive ones you got? Other expensive, most expensive ones are in here. All in here? Stuff. Yeah. It goes most expensive from the bottom, I think. Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah. I just skip past the first edition German you got that uh, grand party you got nine legendary collection pretty sick uh, one of my favorite ones the Dell species crystal guardian one there yeah Charizards for days and from more just more Charizards in here right yeah yeah, just, uh, yeah everything you know all price ranges and stuff but like the binders mainly vintage right yeah mainly, mainly. Vintage. Mainly. like vintage check out. More. yeah <laughs> no, no, six, six. Now. here is where people can come and trade it's pretty cool, obviously got some vendors, but down here you can yeah. just chill, sit down and trade, which is good. So we've got L's trading cards and comics. These guys always got some sick older stuff, like your childhood. Like nostalgia here with the football cards, the older stuff. As you can see, all the binders, like Merlin binders. Over there, 999, 98. Um, yeah, look, some modern match tax there. But we got some other stuff, like other TCGs, are like other franchises. Look, look, you got your Michael Jackson, you got Elvis, all sorts. So if you like their cool variety of cards, make sure to check them out. Oh yeah, let's go, let's go. What else do they have? So you see like Doctor Who, Dragon Ball, Star Wars, Dinosaur Kit. That sounds familiar. Hmm. That sounds familiar, I don't know why. But you are sick, and then yeah. So boom with my boy Trip, aka Quartz Collectibles, aka Essex Card Show. When is Essex Card Show again? November 11th. I'll pop it on the screen, guys. But they'll he also sells at these events as well. So we'll show you what he's got. He's got some bits in here. What's the best, most expensive bit? That looks cool. That Venus professor. Yeah, got Tactoid Venusaur. Oh yeah, nice. Venusaur all out of there. That binder's nice. That's binder's nice. Yeah, yeah. I'll buy for these. So yeah, you got some older stuff in there. What's this like? EX era there. So, um, I was like, so you got the older stuff in these binders here. Is that one like set order then? Yeah. Oh, okay. So, but if you're looking for some of these cards, you find them there. You got some Sun and Moon probably here. Sun and Moon XY there. And then we got some vintage Watsi, it looks like in here. Yeah, Watsi all in that one. And then we've got some Chinese packs, we've got the Japanese, Chinese fat packs. Got the Pokemon pins from Worlds for only fifteen pounds sale plus twenty. We got the files there. We got the tattoo box. 
These tattoos are probably older than some people. What year we're looking at? Does it have a date on the box? Yeah, 90, 98, 90, 2000, I think, maybe. 2000, so maybe older than some viewers. Right there. I've got some One Piece, Scott, uh, Paldia, and a puzzle. I've never seen the Pokemon puzzles at the card shows. Who you trade them? Nice, Raven's Burger account. Yeah, yeah. So Raven's Burger, if you don't know, they make puzzles, but they also make an Olacana set, which is coming out. Yeah, nice little puzzle, 11 quid. So uh, sick. Boy, how does Galex here? He's busy, busy. So we'll show you what he's got anyways. Uh, we've got the Pokemon Center stuff from Pokemon Center Japan, which is pretty cool. Some nice accessories if you like those. And then we've got some packs displays. We've got some binders full of stuff as well. We've got packs and packs. Banging cards here, guys, as always. Where are we looking at? Look at this. Look at the Chinese Lagos Ladios. There's some awesome old arts in there as well. As you can see, you got the Garatinas. Picaron breaks in. The munches over there. What are we saying, Hadis? Good? Nice run, yeah. Good, good. I got gold stars. Ooh, Ladios, Ladios. English there with the above skies. All arts. Uh, EV. Lost Abyss. Japanese era. Uh, Giratina. There's a giant Nala behind there. No, oh my gosh. Oh my god. Some more gold Excuse stars me? up top. Yeah. Um, I don't mean to be a pain. Yeah, okay. I have that copy instead of these two. This one, yeah, sure. Yeah. That's the card that I've been wanting for so long. Yeah. So what, what else are we picking up a little shiny chariots out there? But yeah, you got gold stars over there. You got some more old arts up top. You got some more vintage. Yeah, you're right. I got some more vintage hollows in that over there. So yeah, shout out to my guy who had his collection. Check him out if you like it. But look at look at the price of the munch promos. If you saw me grading these at the beginning of the year, they were like a quarter of that price. So that's why you watch my videos. Get in on those deals while while you can. So um, we've got like 8 bits planet here, which have a shop in this area, Bristol, I believe. So yeah, we've got some cool slabs, we've got the vintage bits in there, some more vintage in there. We've got the vintage singles in here, and I think modern is on this side, so we'll have a look over there as well, guys. You can see you got that old art, Blastoise, you got oh, it's a mixture of vintage and modern, but yeah, that Gengar Prime looks sick. Yeah, that and then we've got some sick singles in here. So yeah, loads and loads of singles from 8-Bit. Check them out, I think they do have a physical shop. For Zard here, guys. So you bought three Japanese Park packs. We're opening them for him. So best of luck, bro. That's right. Oh, I got the card. Yeah. Oh, I guess I want the pack, but I want the card. Well. <laughs> Obviously, it is to say you want to get a chair out, but yeah, I appreciate that. It's open, man. Do you need any sleeves? It is raining, but there is a KFC. We're at a sports bar there. It's a KFC, so I'm getting a KFC right now, though. Okay, see break. Oh, this is for the chairs I've got from our packs. Let's go. I have a fancy signature. I appreciate it, bro. Thank you. He also has pork and Oh, that's mine. Thank you so much. Cheers. Hold on. I'm, I'm gambling with Dean right here. He wants these. So well, I'm calling it. All right, heads. I get for 50. If he it gets tails, then I have to pay 55. I've already given you a discount. He's already it's giving me the, the case, discount, right? anyways, but. Tails, 55. So gambling has what? You, you set me up there. <laughs> so 55 for these two from my guy, Dean. Let's go. Nine there, my love. Look at that. Japanese. I don't have many Japanese Ultra Shining GXs. So I definitely need to grab some more. But yeah, nine there. This one for 20 odd quid. Yeah, I can't go wrong. PSA 9 as well, but can't go wrong with that. Basically, raw price. So, we're on Pokey Stu. We've got one of the Pokey Chloe, Pokey D Mystery Packs. Let's see what pack you got in here. The stars, got Shiny Fates, and Pink, which is the, the uh, lowest <laughs> one. Well, let's see if we can sell at least like celebrations or something juicy. Oh, okay, okay. At least it's not like a photo one. Yeah. It's a decent sort of show pack there. Is it Pokey Chloe sticker in there as well? Yeah, it should be. But yeah, if you've seen, we have opened these on our channel. We actually hit a vintage and a banging pool. So check it out on the channel, guys. So, boom, I traded these. So someone took these and I got, I have put them in already, but I got four God cards, five God cards, actually, from the uh, V-Star Universe. So we've got a Pichiana Marie, Raya Lu, Harris, and Badoof for those. So it works out a little bit my way. Obviously, it might take longer to sell more cards, but... Yo, he wanted these, so we done a deal. So yeah, not bad, not bad. All right, we've got another mystery grade. Let's see what he's got. Got my guy Zetro, if you don't know. Does Minecraft content, check him out. Mm -hmm. He's got no face though, so. I've never seen anyone destroy a mystery pack like this. <laughs> All right, we've got PSA. Oh, Japanese. Ooh, oh, you know what? That's nice. Look at the shine on that. That is nice. Oh. Could be profit, mate. Could be profit. 
So boom guys, that is the end of the vlog. I did forget to record the outro there, but yes, we did pick up a couple bits there as you saw in the vlog and a few other bits as well. But I did pick up these boxes as you saw. Those will be ripped on the channel. So if you want to see that, make sure to like and subscribe. Uh, but yeah, we always do go do these card show vlogs. So if you like those vlogs, again, subscribe guys, because I always do these videos to show you guys what it's like there, what you can expect to see. And hopefully it's useful. You find it informative. I meet a lot of you guys that find these events through my videos, which is awesome. Uh, and yeah, this is Southwest Card Show's first one. So if you haven't heard of it before, now you heard of it and then we can catch you maybe at the next one. We should be at the next one. It's run by Gav, who does Cardiff in Manchester, which are awesome events. So big shout out to him. So I want to go start going to more card shows. So stay tuned as well. Maybe next year or end of the year, we'll start doing different ones that we haven't been to yet. So stay tuned for that, guys. But yeah, check out this website. One of my boys, uh, Trip, who, uh, AK Essex Card Show runs it and it gives you a list of all the card shows in the UK. So you can kind of plan out and see which one's local to you that you may want to visit. So check them out, guys. Uh, but again, we will be at London Card Show, which is the biggest one in the UK, and we'll be selling both days there. And that's in August, so check that one out as well, guys. We'll be selling there. Can't wait to, uh, for that one, because that one is always mega. But yes, guys, make sure to like and subscribe for more card show vlogs, more Pokemon openings, etc. And yeah, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.